Welcome. My name is John Brunswick and we're going to be looking at the Internet of Customers and the Internet of Things today. If you've seen the Iron Man movie, Tony Stark has a computer system called Jarvis. And one of my favorite scenes is when he wakes up in the morning and Jarvis greets him with the news and other activities relevant to him. What we're going to do today is we have a display that's set up that's communicating over web sockets to our version of Jarvis. And what we're going to do is using an Arduino device with Bluetooth connectivity and Wi-Fi, this device here is going to listen for any Bluetooth signals coming from our cell phones. So what we'll see in a moment is my wife, Catherine, is going to be joining us. She's going to walk in, she's going to be greeted, and then I'm going to walk in and be greeted, and we'll watch everything take place real time right here. Good afternoon, Catherine. You currently have one task. Task one, finalize marketing materials for upcoming Internet of Things conference. So you can see that the system just greeted Catherine based on her physical presence. Now, I've arrived. Let's see what the system does for Good me. Good afternoon, John. You currently have two tasks. Task one, finalize travel for San Francisco meetings. Task two, email Don Wilson about the sales meeting next week. Now, I might not be Tony Stark, and my wife probably agrees with that, but I'm able to get a little piece of Jarvis-like capability within my own house. Now, within our companies, we can use these Internet of Things, Internet of Customer type approaches to give ourselves the key information just based on where we move around throughout the day. So. Over the next week or so, I'll put all the source code online and I look forward to our next video.